Hey everyone, welcome to my channel guys and yes, I will be reacting to another song from Coke Studio Bangla. This song is called uh, Bhinno Tar Utshab. Uh, so I am guessing this is going to be a celebratory song but I just want to see what the uh, description says because they always give the synopsis of the song. So the Coke Studio Bangla brings different people from different places, uniting them with one love for different music. Okay, the song praises our ways of settling differences by connecting in a more harmonious manner, accepting that each of us are unique in our own ways. Wow, you know, that's really important, I feel, because uh, right now we are at this juncture in our world where any opinion that you present on the table, if it does not match with the other person's opinion, you are tagged as a hater. You know that you are an anti or something like that. So if, I think the concept of every individual is unique and opinions can differ and you know the openness to listen to a different perspective, a different opinion is just diminishing which is really sad and if the song is talking about that, I'm very very happy that you know accepting each other which are that are unique in our own ways. It's the kind of coexistence that is seen at every other home where two supporters of competing teams can celebrate together under the same roof and share the joys and tears of the outcome. Okay, be it sports, music or any other occasion, it is a spectacle to witness the madness unfold when it comes to celebrating our differences. That's, that's kind of cool. That's kind of cool. That's, I don't think I've ever heard a song which covers this topic. To be very honest, I've never heard a song covering this kind of topic. So yeah, Bhinno Tar Utshab. Oh, Bhinno Tar Utshab. We are so, all of us are different, but we are celebrating that different. Bhinno Bhinno Lokera. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, let's listen to this song now. Something is written in Bangla. Nanan Dharo. So I don't know. I I can read very little. Uh, so I'll, I'll read it. I'll read it later. So, I can read it very slowly, slowly. So. Oh, that's different. That's different, it's not a set. Oh, this I like. This is something different.
This might as well be an ad for Coca Cola. Okay. So, Bhimnotar Utshab, huh? the celebration of diversity, celebration of, you know, being different and unique and owning it basically. I love the messaging of the song and the way the video has been shot. Literally, the lyrics, if you just say, see the lyrics, uh, this might as well be a co an ad like this song can be kind of utilized in a Coca Cola ad also. I mean, in, in Bangladesh, basically. <laughs> if Coca Cola is promoting its ad or you know, its product there, then this song can be easily used and it belongs to kind of them only, you know, it belongs to Coke Studio. So, beautifully shot. This was, I was, I was not expecting it to be like a journey kind of song with life, but it totally makes sense that the song is shot this way because otherwise you don't get the feel of the song where the entire crowd is hyping you up, they're traveling. So, this, this kind of fits into the theme. I think till now, all any from all the Coke Studio Bangla songs that I've listened to, I think Bulbuli is, a, I mean, my favorite till now because I keep listening to that song a lot. It's it's kind of in loop. So whenever it plays in the in you know whenever it uh, appears on my playlist, I am still like completely you know jamming and singing to the song. So I love Bulbuli. So till now, I think even if I uh, this song is very very nice, beautiful, kind of heartwarming, and also it's vibey. But I think till now of whatever songs I've listened to, like nothing has surpassed the magic that I had felt while listening to Bulbuli. Uh, so yeah, that was and I think now a couple of more songs are left because I plan to. Uh, uh, like finish all the songs like I want to watch all the songs so I think right now after this you have Shob Loke Koi uh, Leela Bali is there uh, Dekhi No Dokhi No Hava sorry Dokhi No Hava uh, Aar Kiya Chhe He Shamalo He Shamalo okay and that's it so we have uh, one two three and four we have four songs left. We have four songs left. So I completely plan on uh, watching all of these songs. And uh, yeah, this was, this was, uh, this made me feel very good. This made me feel very good because I feel that the messaging, we need more songs in the world like these. We need more songs in the world like these where, where, you know, we celebrate diversity. We celebrate being different. We celebrate differences of opinion and we celebrate respect for one another. I feel that, that, that respect part in the world is diminishing like people have stopped respecting each other people have stopped respecting each other it's like it's like my way or highway sometimes you have to be firm on your opinion and you have to defend it with logic you know you it's it's nothing there's nothing wrong in being firm on your opinion and having that self-respect and dignity but that shouldn't come at a cost of disrespecting others and putting the other person down that i'm going to put the other person down and i'm going to feel better about myself I don't think it works that way and it shouldn't work that way. The world doesn't work that way because unless and until you have mutual respect, like, okay, if I have a difference of opinion, I'm like, fine, my opinion is this because of one, two, three, four points and the other person is also defending it with his or her logic. That So either you come into a compromise, either you convince the other person, that person convinces me or I convince the other person and otherwise you come into a compromise or otherwise you part ways. So all these things can be done in a much more dignified and respectful manner while without putting the other person down. So I think we need more songs like Vinodar Utsha because yes, you have, we should celebrate that everybody is different and unique in their own way. Uh, and at the end, love wins. So at the end, love really wins. And I think the world is still maintaining its sanity till now because most of the human beings you know, most of the human beings are nice. And I, I just got reminded when I'm saying this, I just got reminded of something that Chris Martin said recently. So Coldplay uh, is having its world tour right now. So currently they had the world tour, their concert in Argentina. And uh, a lot of places it was getting live streamed in cinema theater. So I also went to watch the concert because I cannot fly to Argentina. So he said at the end, like in the middle of a set, he said that, uh, you know, if you go out, if you interact with people, if you meet people generally outside, people are nice. No, nobody wants to fight. People are generally nice and kind and lovable and they don't want trouble. Like people want to live in harmony and peace. But 
what gets projected here on social media it's very different from the actual reality where you and i people like you and me we go out and we just want to chill and have a good time so people generally are nice and that's why i feel that world has its sanity intact because generally people are nice generally generally the the worst kind of people are they, you can't change their thinking because there are certain people who's changing you can you who's thinking you can't change no matter what so that's why the song is essential i feel and i'm glad that coke studio bangla brought the song on the platform so yes that was the reaction those were my thoughts on binotar utsav and i hope you guys enjoyed watching this reaction and uh, yeah share in your thoughts in the comments below and with that i will end this video here and i'll see you soon on my next one bye